It is time to head to Pet Supplies Plus, where we're getting a cooking lesson on how to make some yummy fall treats for our fur babies. In fact, they're so good, we almost want to eat. We might want to eat them. Take a look. Today we're at Pet Supplies Plus. We love this place, don't we? On Glenstone with our friends Marissa and her son Camden, and they've been a little busy making some treats for animals, guys. This looks wonderful. Yes. So I had a big helper last night to prepare. Um, some treats that are great for the Thanksgiving holiday. Wait, these aren't people treats though, right? No. They look good enough to oh, eat. Oh, they look good enough to eat. Yeah. I, I wanted to grab one. Like, no. like some of them are frozen. They look like you <laughs> can just pop them in your mouth. Yeah. That's right. So the very first one here is the, um, it's a cranberry, real cranberries in there. And then um, our primal uh, cranberry goat milk, which is really good for urinary tract, um, can be good for dogs and cats. So all we did last night was mix these together, and then we've got these cute little trays. And you can buy those anywhere. Um, and then you have a nice little treat to give during the holidays for the cat or dog. How cute is that? Yeah, that is cute. Do they love the frozen frozen treats? Yeah. 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 And yeah. you can buy this the cranberry milk yes. here? Uh-huh. You sure oh, can. Oh, wow. Yeah, it comes frozen, so you'll find it in our freezer section. Okay. Um, but once you get home, you just put it in the refrigerator for a little while, and it will thaw out. And then oh, that's so you're ready, ready to serve. How long does it take to freeze them? How long does it take? Um, to freeze these guys? So yeah. I did this overnight. Overnight. Just overnight, oh, okay. and they were ready to go this morning. Um, and the next one we have, this is the shepherd's pie for dogs. And um, again, this is our primal product. So you'll have um, the little pronto treats here, and then you'll have the frozen nuggets. They're both frozen. Again, you'll find those in the freezer section. And um, the recipe just calls for those and some of our power green toppers and mix them together with a little bit of goat's milk and you come out with this yummy treat for the dog. This could be actually a meal right here. Oh, I yes, it is. It could. Yeah. yeah, that'd be great. That'd be like summertime. four meals yeah. for my dog, so they're small. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah, and we have this cute little dish that we put it in, and we put it in the freezer for a little while, and then that's what came out. Dogs oh. want to be healthy, too. we got to keep our dogs right. healthy. You yeah. know, I just thought, of, I, yeah. you know, when you have a dog with a health issue, I didn't even realize all the things you could buy here at Pet Supplies yes. Plus to help with that, like including the goat's milk. And, yeah. And I think that's so great you guys mm -hmm. offer that. Yeah, yeah, it's good. Very oh. healthy, very healthy for the dogs. Um, good for fiber um, in their diet, stuff like yeah. that, urinary tract, and even some joint health in there, too. Yeah, that's good. I yeah. need that. It's like kids camouflage it. Like they won't exactly. eat a cranberry probably, <laughs> yeah. but they will your, eat it in the fruits drink. And yes. Vegetables, yes. yes. Um, and the last one, Camden and I had a lot of fun doing this one. <laughs> this one you have to put in the blender. Ooh. But this is the pumpkin spice latte for dogs. Oh, it's so, so cute. this one calls for the goat's milk and primal, um, the pumpkin spice, and then some of the awesome squash uh, topper from Primal. Yeah. You put it in the blender. And then you get this yummy little drink here, and then you get to top it off with a little bit of uh, oh, look at that whipped cream. Uh, they get their dessert too. That's right. And then a little bit of cinnamon. Oh, we don't want to do it all the way. <laughs> be a lot of cinnamon. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> we do it like this, and then oh. it's ready to go. Wow. So that these is are so really cute. these. Camden and I had so much fun making these last night. Um, it was kind of like a mother son yeah. you know holiday thing that we did for the pets instead of making the cookies or making the, the pet treats so. yeah i can picture the family gathering around making and doing the dogs this the, yes. you know holiday treats before they start the people food well my yeah. husband would accuse me of that he's like mm -hmm. you cook more for the dogs than you cook for me <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so, I see that. Yeah. And what are these bags right here? So if this is just too much to handle during the holidays, because we all know we're super busy, yeah. um, any of these products here, uh, the toppers or the goat's milk, are great um, treat to add onto your dog's kibble, dog or cat's kibble. Good idea. Good idea. Um, so yeah, if you just don't have time, those are an option as well. So it is so great. Um, and I think it helps. You know, it kind of breaks it down a little bit, makes it a little softer, softer. for them to eat. Yep. I'm noticing that the goat's milk is what we're using, and is that better for the dogs? Yes. So um, each, we have four different flavors of the goat's milk in the 32 ounce. So we have pumpkin, we have cranberry, we also have blueberry, mm -hmm. and then we have the kale. So each of them have something that's great for um, the dog's health. Um, this one being uh, urinary tract, 
and this one being for like um, joint health and stuff nice. like that. So, um, and then of course these toppers here, great nutritional value in them as well. That's awesome. Now, Camden, just one quick question. When you were making this with your mom last night, did you see this and think, oh my gosh, that looks so good, you wanted to try it, Camden? Did you try some last night? <laughs> no. You didn't think about just wanting a little sip? <laughs> no. Would you, would, would, you, would you drink that? You know what he did? If I didn't what? know, I would <laughs> drink it. Yeah, it looks good enough. But it does look great. this is what I found in the kitchen. Oh. That's what was oh. fun about it. That's so. awesome. <laughs> Look how much fun you can have at Pet Supplies Plus, helping your pets, making holiday treats, and fun with the family. It's, I mean, that's all you need. What's not to love? All you need. And you have five locations. Yes, we have five locations, four in Springfield and one in Nixa. Guys, right. come check it out for everything you need for the holidays for your pets. Pet Supplies Plus, you got to check it out. Thanks, guys, so much. Yeah, thank you for having okay, us. Okay, one more. Come on, okay. Camden. Come on, Camden. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> That is so fun. I wanted to do that to you. I, we should have, actually. But yeah, we were good. out of whipping cream. Remember yeah, when we were. that happened? Uh, uh, by the way, I just want to say, they do have other locations. By the way, I went to one of their other locations last week. Where'd you go? I went to the one that was on North, uh, not North, I'm sorry, uh, West Battlefield. OK. Um, by Kansas Expressway yes. and Battlefield. I was there eating lunch, and I walked in, I'm like, Pest supplies was I needed um, some um, some supplements and stuff for one of my dogs. Oh, good, good, and I went, good, good. I'm so glad it's, right it's here. here. And I'm so lucky there's one right in Nixa. Oh, that's so in perfect. In that same shopping center with uh, uh, Sally's, and um, it's really handy right there. Yes. Yeah. All right, check out their recipes at primalpetfoods.com. The perfect pups giving feast, <laughs> the uh, pumpkin spice latte. You can also go to any Pet Supplies Plus location to make donations to local rescue organizations and help them stay supplied. Yes, and Pet Supplies Plus. Plus, your local pet store carrying a wide variety of foods, toys, and supplies for any pet. And they have four locations in Springfield, one in Nixa. I went to one of the other ones, and I loved it. Yes. You can check them out online at PetSuppliesPlus.com. Yes. I did. I went in there because I needed some you medicine. You said vitamins. You give well, your dogs vitamins? Here, I'll be honest with you. One of, <laughs> well, we say it all. <laughs> My little dog, Whitney Houston, is having a little incontinence problem. Oh. So she's in a diaper right now. So I had Thank to go goodness get for doggy diapers, diapers. guys. Ugh. But Pet Supplies Plus have little uh, things to help with bladder control. Oh. The little pills. Oh. And they taste really good because Whitney Houston just nibbles them right up. No, it looks brown. Huh. But they're, they're pills. I cut them up for her and she just eats them. So we're hoping this will be something to help so. with her incontinence. Yeah. So yeah. I'm sorry to be so you know, open, but that's what ha happened. Thank goodness we have all those things to help yes. our pets. Yes, and our... thank goodness for Pet Supplies Plus. We love you guys. All right, we'll be back right after this with Best Bids. What is it? It's going to be good, y'all. Okay. It's going to be real good. <laughs>